Hello everyone, in this video I will be solving Cambridge IGCSC Information and Communication Technology Paper 2 for May June 2023. I am going to solve the presentation task which is task 4. The document and database are already solved and uploaded. You can find the link in the description. Task 4 presentation you are going to create a short presentation. Create a presentation of six slides using the file j2321 scratch.rtf. For that first open PowerPoint. So we need to import this file j2321 scratch.rtf. For that click on a blank presentation. In order to import the file click on new slide slides from outline and select your folder and open the file j2321 scratch you can see a blank slide here delete that so you have six slides given unless instructed the slides must display a title and a bulleted list use a master slide to display only the following features so in order to create the master slide go to view slide master when you create the slide master you need to make sure you select the first slide the topmost slide you can see here three text holders we'll delete this and use text boxes whenever we need automated slide numbers on the top right so on top right let's insert a text box and keep the cursor inside the text box go to insert slide number this is the slide number which is represented by hash so the slide number is inserted on the top right your name center number and candidate number on the bottom left so insert a text box on the bottom left give your name center number and candidate number and make sure it's left aligned a three to four point wide horizontal line about 3 cm from the bottom of the slide above your details and across the full width of the slide. Just resize this and click on view ruler. So almost 3 cm almost here we need to draw a line horizontal line approximately so go to insert shapes you can draw the line press shift when you draw the line so that it will be a straight line we need to make sure it is 3 to 4 point the width must be 3 to 4 point so go to shape outline weight 3 point let's make it black since they have not specified any color black and the weight is 3 point no master slide items must overlap or it, sh it should appear on every slide so the master slide is done so you can close the master slide slide master close master view just make sure the slide number the name and the line is there on every slide format the first slide so that a title layout is applied with no bullets the title and subtitle text are center line and in the middle of the slide so for the first slide this is the first slide so right click layout give the title slide layout so automatically the title and subtitle are set to the center of the slide use the data in the file j2321 winners
open J2321 winners. To create a pie chart, to create a pie chart to compare the number of race wins by each group. So number of race wins by each group. So select the group and the number. Don't select total. Only the group and the number. Insert. We need a pie chart. Label the chart with the title percentage wins by group. percentage wins by group format the chart to display only group names and percentages as sector labels so click on the chart properties data labels click on this go for more options so the names, group names and the percentage must be shown as the sector labels. So show category name, no need of value, instead of that show the percentage. Position these labels outside each chart sector. So the label position here you can see make it outside and and display the percentage values to one decimal point so click on number sorry percentage and the decimal place must be 1. Do not display a legend. So click on the legend. Don't select the legend. So the legend is not displayed. This is the required chart. Emphasize the group with the largest percentage by pulling only this sector away from the other groups. So the largest sector is this one. Just click twice on that sector and then move it away from the other group. Place the chart to the right of the bullets on the slide with the title Scratch Group Cyclist. So let's copy the chart. Scratch group cyclist. We need to place the chart to the right of the bullets. So resize the bullets and then place the chart here. Make sure that no words are split. All the data and labels are fully visible. The chart and its contents do not overlap any slide items. So everything is okay. Add the following text as presenter notes to the slide with the title Scratch Group Cyclist. So we need to add this as the presenter note to the slide. So here you can see notes option. Click on notes so that you can add the notes here. So this is the notes. Add the notes here. Race winner analysis 38 races completed in 2022. Print only this slide as presenter notes in portrait orientation. In order to print this slide with the presenter notes, you need to go to File, Print, and then 
here you need to give notes pages and give the slide number the slide number is 6 so this will be printed to make sure that your candidate details are displayed on the header of footer because here the name is too small when it is printed so make sure your candidate details are printed on the header of footer for that click on edit header of footer select header give your candidate details there so your details will be shown here next on the slide with the title handicaps format the text race director so that when clicked it opens an email editor ready to send a message to this email id so we need to go to the slide with the title handicaps so you need to create a hyperlink from race director so right click you can see link option click on link The link must be to send an email message with this ID. So click on email address and you have to use the email ID here rd at cambridge.org. With the subject line race handicaps. So subject line. race handicaps place in your evidence document a screenshot showing the link text email address and subject so we need to take the screenshot of this window and that is your step 31 evidence save the presentation so okay you can save the presentation print the full presentation at handouts in portrait orientation with two slides to the page so to print that go to file print all slides must be printed and make sure it is printed as two slides per page so this is how you need to print the presentation next task 5 printing the evidence document now we have finished all the tasks you have to print the evidence document for all the previous tasks and this one so this is the end of the task you can find the other task in the description